everybody, welcome back to my channel. Are you ready for, I think, what is the last haul uh, for fall? Um, I did two before this, and then this one, I think I'm pretty much all done. If I do go out again, it'll be for last minute things. Uh, but this one today is from um, Home Goods and Hobby Lobby. So let's get started. So we're gonna start with Home Goods, and I will tell you the prices because I know people like to know what you pay. So We'll start off first by, oh, by the way, it's beautiful today. I hope you get relief where you're from. It's about 80 degrees, it's dry, it's unbelievable. It's, uh, I've got a nice breeze coming through the family room, so uh, I could shut the air off, the windows are up, it's really, really nice. So I hope your day is the same. So anyway, we'll start with a set of 12 napkins. I'm gonna move up a little bit closer here which I thought were really pretty. Um, they have the combination of the mustard color, gold or gold color, whatever you wanna call it, and the rust. I have six of these and then six of the solid. So I actually have six chairs in my dining room. Maybe I'll use these for a place setting. And these here, you can use uh, whether you drape it in a, um, over a tray, you can line it in the basket. So we'll see what I end up using them for. But so those, like I said, were $14.99 for 12 of them. So I thought those were pretty. Got a couple dish towels. You always got to pick up some dish towels, right, for the season. Um, I didn't really see a lot that I loved. Uh, these were pretty. I liked the colors in, in them. It's a set of two for $7.99. They got the gourds and the pumpkins on them. Uh, a little bit of sad news, everybody. Oh, my goodness. So I got this cute acorn. Let me tell you my acorn story. It's got the gold top. Okay, I love the detail. So I was... So I have all my fall stuff downstairs in a tub or bucket, whatever you want to call it. And I was on my way up. I don't know what happened, but I looked down. I'm like, oh no, all this, a lot of ceramic stuff had broken and was on the carpet. I'm like, oh no. So do I go back for a 9.99 acorn? I'm not really sure. It's a little bit out of the way. So I don't know, we'll have to see. But that was my, uh, my acorn that I, I loved. And uh, we'll have to see what happens if I go back or not. So, a little bit of sad news. All right. So then I got this tray. I believe this is the last item from Home Goods. Didn't get a ton there. This tray's really heavy. This was $19.99. It's got the black handles, which goes nice in my um, kitchen. I've got the bronze hardware, the multicolor granite. It's got some black in it. So I thought that would look really nice. And trays are awesome. You can use trays so many different ways, don't you think? I've got a bunch of them. All right, so that's that. I actually, so Hobby Lobby's next. I actually went there first and got another tray and then saw this one at Home Goods. So I, I got two actually on my shopping trip, but that's okay. Like I said, you can always use them. So Hobby Lobby was 40% off. Uh, I got one item from the spring collection, which was 75% off. Uh, make sure you check that section out. Um, they have a lot of vases and just things you can use all year, you know, so. All right, we'll start off with Amber glass, no big surprise there, right? This was $7.99, kind of neat. They have a smaller one, and I think two sizes after this. I probably should have got the bigger one, and I'll, I'll show you why. I got these this beautiful floral. What about their florals, everybody? Aren't they beautiful? I had a hard time picking. I only got this one, actually, because I do have some from last year. So I'm going to wait and see when I decorate. If I need more, I'll go and get some. But um, this was $12.99. You guys do the math. Okay. Um but I thought this was really pretty with the leaves. They've got green, they've got the rust, they've got the mustard and this here, I don't even know what you call that. So this was my plan was to pair these together, but the stem is really long. I know you can cut it and this, you won't even be able to see, I don't think all of it, um, but it's really tall. So even if I was to cut it, I think this would be, I probably should have got the bigger one, still too tall for this size vase. So we'll have to see. I'm sure I'll use these somehow. Um, so that was my vision there and we know what happens with our vision sometimes, right? I did get a square riser for $9.99 uh, with the black legs. I have two round ones. Uh, I usually use one for my soaps in the kit, uh, kitchen area, but you know, good idea, your kitchen soaps, your bathroom soaps or whatever else, you put a candle on there, right? So I finally got a square one put that down there. I got this little leaf for $9.99. I thought this was really pretty. I loved the detail in it. You know, whether you leave it like this or fill it with a little bit of candy, 
You actually could put some uh, special soap in there for the bathroom. That would be pretty too, right? Yeah, I liked that a lot. All right, so this was from the spring collection. I've been eyeing this a long time. I love this. I love the color combination of the white and the wood. I thought that was really, really pretty. So listen to this. This was $39.99. Uh, and 75% off, $5.99, $7.99, I think it came to, but I love this. Um, I have some fall potpourri, I think that's what you call it. I could put that in there. You could put the wooden beads and just drape them over, right? Whatever you want. Um, but I thought that was really, really pretty, and I'm glad I got a bargain on that. Let me move this over here. So I got this um, pumpkin. This was $39.99, very popular price at Hobby Lobby. Um, and I came home and, you know, $23.99, I think it was. And I wondered if that was kind of a lot, but it's got beautiful detail. <clears throat> I'll put a candle in the back so it'll look pretty lit up somewhere. And I've eyed these for a long time. What about the variety of pumpkins there? Oh my goodness, they have a ton of them. The sweater pumpkins, the wood pumpkins, the ceramic. They're really all really, really pretty. That down carefully. I don't want that to break like my poor acorn. All right, here's uh. So like I said, I went to Hobby Lobby first and got this tray, which is very lightweight, and then saw the other one at Home Goods. This has the um, beads for the handles. This again, thirty nine ninety nine. So I think it was twenty one or twenty three. I think it's twenty three. Um, but very lightweight. But these go nice on even like a coffee. Uh, I don't have a coffee bar. I have coffee bar envy, actually, as well as pantry envy. Uh, but in my, I call it my coffee corner, but anywhere on a counter, you can use these. If you don't have a special table for a coffee, a coffee bar, and you want one, just use a tray. Put your cake cups down, your mugs, uh, or whatever else. But trays, trays are awesome. Like I said, I have a few of them, and I use them quite a bit. And the picture. Hello, fall. That was on sale. I think the original was 46. I paid 35.99, I believe. I was going to order it online, but the shipping was like another $10 and I had to go to Hobby Lobby anyway, so I picked it up when I was there. And my mantle, which I don't think you can see the whole thing, is very high. It's a beautiful mantle, but it's very high. Anything I put up there has to be kind of big so it shows. So I'm going to probably put that there, and I have those uh, picks that kind of droop over. I'll probably add those in. We'll have to see. Uh, and I didn't film inside of Hobby Lobby because I'm a little behind the eight ball, and I'm okay with that. Um, but by now, I think most people know what the stores are offering, so I just thought I'd get right to the haul and show you what I got. It wasn't huge, but I hope you did enjoy it. Maybe you got some uh, ideas for your own house. Also, you know what I forgot to tell you, everybody? Um, obviously, if you like what you see today, uh, like and subscribe. I do um, dinner ideas, baking, shopping hauls, anything lifestyle. But also follow me on Instagram at Heidi's Humble Home. I don't post every day, but I am on there. Thank you, everybody, and have a great day.